Hello everyone, this is the Prussian Prince. So, wait another Total War Attila tournament match cast. This is Barbarian Team Tournament Group Stage Group A uh, match between Chosen Hunnic Riders of Attila, just calling them Chosen for short, and uh, Zeal. This is the first 1v1 match, uh, game rather, between uh, Way of Chosen playing as Hans and Arctic Shieldbreaker of Zeal in command of. Uh, command of the Eastern Romans so uh, let's go over the compositions here we have Ford Huns again uh, Wei is in command of them step chieftain bronze one with fast charge then two noble actually a noble step counterfact bronze one on the right with a bronze one elite Hunnic Lancer then on the left Elite Hunnic Lancer Bronze 1 with a Bronze 1 Noble Step Counterfract. Then we see on the field just two Step Lancers as well. For Infantry Contingent we have about four of these War Warriors. Then we see up front two Step Bows. And actually make that six War Warriors. Of course there would be six War Warriors. Uh, then we have looks like four Skirmish Scout in total. Wow. Two Step Mounted Bows on the right, two Step Mounted Bows on the left. So that is a lot of cav on the field. Eight cav, nine cav counting the gen for the Huns. That is an insane amount of cav, actually. That is insane, indeed. And uh, wow, that's just, that is just crazy. <laughs> uh, because, uh, I mean, this is allowed though, and but bringing four skirmish cav could be insane here. We'll see if it can actually be used effectively, though. It's just a lot of cav. I mean, rear charging is still going to be important. And by the way, I need to put it in slow-mo to go over the East Roman build of Arctic Shieldbreaker. Oh, yes, looks like separated in two, two flanks. He has his general here, Palatina Guards, with a brace. Then he has, looks like on this flank, three Tegmata Cav, one of which is Bronze 1. Then on the right, we see... What do we see? Two Cav. It is two Klibanari. And that will be the calf contingent for uh, the Eastern Romans. Then skirmish contingent, two Funitores on each flank, it seems. And two Heteraeus with an Eastern Armor Legio on the right. Uh, I believe a Heterea, two Heteraeus on the left with an Eastern Armored Legio. And here comes the engagement. As you can see, this bow unit stopping these units and getting a decent charge off here. This Heteria Guard is about to get rear charged here too. As you can see, these units, the Step Mounted Bow is dying without doing too much damage, but it's already dropped this Heteria Guard significantly. Elite Hunnic Lancers here getting a charge off, lots of kills on these units. And now another Cav Charge off here. This Step Lancer does not actually get a Cav Charge off, that is something to keep in mind. Very nice micro here by East Romans, Heteria pulling out and then coming back in. Uh, this Lancer though, Elite Hunnic Lancer getting ready to go into these Heterias though. Uh, nice micro here by the Huns. Looks like these two step mounted bows will be used to target that Heteria as well. But these Lancers got, uh, went in without support and these guys just died without. Uh, I mean, they were totally out micro. Uh, not really micro. Wars coming in, but very, very late actually. Has to be kept in mind. These elite Hunnic Lancers coming in. More noble step cataphracts alive here. But these units here not doing great at all for. Uh, for the Eastern Romans, this cav engagement here. Ooh, Elite Hunnic Lancer is going to pull out, and in doing so, losing a lot of men. Here, not as much, but here come the wars. They're going to get a really nice charge off. And we're going to have a rear charge by these Noble Step Cataphracts into all these units, and then more wars pouring into the fight. Still some Cataphracts left here, but very nice cav charges here by the Eastern Romans into both of these war warriors. Actually, this war gets destroyed on the charge. This war gets destroyed on the charge. Wow. However, the general of the Eastern Romans is also dead, and all these units now are going to chain route off the field. Uh, this Stigmata going to hold here, but this whole flank for the Eastern Romans has died. Now we're going to see an elite Hunnic Lancer charge here, but not doing the best. Klebanari too. Hatria Guard stopped here and taking some damage as it's pulling out. Uh, but still the Stigmata holding out, out, out all of these ores here. The thing is that the general is dead for the Eastern Romans, which could be important. Very nice step mounted bows. Uh, charges over here as you can see destroying these hurlers there's gonna be more charges as well these units I don't know what they were doing the monarch have chasing something it seems 
step mounted bows I guess and they killed them off but they're not gonna be in time for the fight potentially we're gonna see a calf charge here by the step lancers straight into Heterea's another calf charge here by noble step cataphracts straight into Heterea's looks like uh, the Klibanari do clip them so the Heterea doesn't get fully charged here and actually it looks like this charge is stopped most of it at least but still gonna do some damage of course Still, the step mounted bows here could actually go around and hit the eastern armor legio from behind or something but all these units of the huns in very nice position here these hentria is going to go off the field due to the step lancer charge this unit is going to go down too noble step cataphracts here actually did more damage than i expected to this hentria guard off the charge but they're going to go in for another calf charge into the hentria is very nice here this hentria going to go down more calf charges into these hentrias as well poor hentrias they, this is not what they were made for. They were made to grind it out. They were not made to fight the, like this. But very nice calf charge here by the Noble Step Cataphracts. Looks like these Step Mountain Bows will route to the Eastern Armored Legio. But it is not going to matter at this point. Wars here trading very well against the Heterias. Heterias barely getting 84 kills here. And all the this Stagmata Cav here and this Heteria is hold, this Heteria holding here because of Headhunt. But that's really just about it. It is game over. So it looks like... Um, Way is going to take the victory here in this 1v1 against Arctic Shield Breaker for uh, Chosen Hunnic Riders of Attila. Uh, very well done here by Way, and I actually liked his build a lot. Very, very cool. But anyway, uh, let's look at the stats. Heitreas, as you can see, all of them completely wasted. And the infantry didn't do much, Punitoris didn't do much, Cab didn't do much, aside from a few Klibanari that... Those two Klibanari that charged those ores, very well done. You can see that there's three ores with zero kills, so well, that's pretty funny. But still, the Huns won. Don't see that too often, but anyway, that is uh, games, uh, games, so hope you all enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to comment, or subscribe, follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Google+. Share the video, and I shall see you next time.